for me, integration is a, a real game changer in Scotland. I worked as a home care organiser uh, in the early 1990s and we dreamed about a world of integration where the services would come together, the budgets would come together and uh, people would get a better service for it. So for me, this is perhaps been a long time coming, but critical to the new world where people should see a seamless service. And we've heard today at the, the conference that uh, for service users and patients, sometimes too many different people coming in and out of their living room. And I think integration can help to make that far a far more personalised service. We're not there yet, but integration is the start of that and uh, I'm very excited about the benefits that we're going to see from that for, for people as we go forward. What will health and social integration look like to you as Cabinet Secretary? Well, it should look to me as it should look to someone receiving services and that is that it's an integrated service, a coherent service with, with a minimal number of people involved in that, getting away from the 101 assessments where people are asked the same questions over and over again to a more streamlined service which is joined up and makes sense to people and supportive so that we can keep people in their own home for as long as possible and the, the success of integration will help to deliver that and to make care and health better uh, for people. We want better outcomes for those receiving services so success will be absolutely uh, that and we'll, of course we'll be uh, wanting to speak to those uh, patients and service users who are on the receiving end of services to make sure that we are getting it right as we take it forward. We've been talking about health and social care integration for a long time in Scotland. What needs to happen now? We need to get on with it because we now have the legislation in place. We now have the integrated joint boards who are responsible for bringing those services together for around uh, over £7.5 billion worth of spend. So there's a great opportunity to make sure that at a local level those boards are delivering not just the existing services in a more joined up and integrated way, but new services and uh, developing and delivering new services that can help to keep people in their own home, avoid hospital admission and to get people home from hospital far quicker. All of that is about better patient care and that's what this is all about. It's about people and making sure that people get a better service.